receptor tyrosine kinase are the high affinity cell surface receptors for many polypeptide growth factors, cytokines, and hormones. Of the 90 unique tyrosine kinase genes identified in the human genome, 58 encode receptor tyrosine kinase proteins. Receptor tyrosine kinases have been shown not only to be key regulators of normal cellular processes but also to have a critical role in the development and progression of many types of cancer. Receptor tyrosine kinases are part of the larger family of protein tyrosine kinases, encompassing the receptor tyrosine kinase proteins which contain a transmembrane domain, as well as the non-receptor tyrosine kinases which do not possess transmembrane domains. Nomenclature Receptor tyrosine kinase in this article is also known as tyrosine receptor kinase or tyrosine kinase receptor depending on the permutation. However, TRK receptor is the name in the context of neurobiology. Receptor tyrosine kinase classes, approximately 20 different RTK classes have been identified. Structure, most RTKs are single subunit receptors but some exist as multimeric complexes, for example, the insulin receptor that forms disulfide linked dimers in the presence of hormone. Moreover, ligand binding to the extracellular domain induces formation of receptor dimers. Each monomer has a single hydrophobic transmembrane spanning domain composed of 25 to 38 amino acids, an extracellular N terminal region, and an intracellular C terminal region. The extracellular N terminal region exhibits a variety of conserved elements, including immunoglobulin like or epidermal growth factor like domains, fibronectin type 3 repeats, or cystine rich regions that are characteristic for each subfamily of RTKs. These domains contain primarily a ligand binding site, which binds extracellular ligands, for example, a particular growth factor or hormone. The intracellular C terminal region displays the highest level of conservation and comprises catalytic domains responsible for the kinase activity of these receptors, which catalyzes receptor autophosphorylation and tyrosine phosphorylation of RTK substrates. Kinase activity in biochemistry, a kinase is a type of enzyme that transfers phosphate groups from high energy donor molecules, such as ATP, to specific target molecules. The process is termed phosphorylation. The opposite, an enzyme that removes phosphate groups from targets, is known as a phosphatase. Kinase enzymes that specifically phosphorylate tyrosine amino acids are termed tyrosine kinases. When a growth factor binds to the extracellular domain of an RTK, its dimerization is triggered with other adjacent RTKs. Dimerization leads to a rapid activation of the protein's cytoplasmic kinase domains the first substrate for these domains being the receptor itself. The activated receptor as a result then becomes autophosphorylated on multiple specific intracellular tyrosine residues. Signal transduction, through diverse means, extracellular ligand binding will typically cause or stabilize receptor dimerization. This allows a tyrosine in the cytoplasmic portion of each receptor monomer to be transphosphorylated by its partner receptor, propagating a signal through the plasma membrane. The phosphorylation of specific tyrosine residues within the activated receptor creates binding sites for SRC homology 2 domain and phosphotyrosine binding domain containing proteins. Specific proteins containing these domains include SRC and phospholipase cycubed. Phosphorylation and activation of these two proteins on receptor binding lead to the initiation of signal transduction pathways. Other proteins that interact with the activated receptor act as adapter proteins and have no intrinsic enzymatic activity of their own. These adapter proteins link RTK activation to downstream signal transduction pathways, such as the MAP kinase signaling cascade. An example of a vital signal transduction pathway involves the tyrosine kinase receptor, CMET, which is required for the survival and proliferation of migrating myoblasts during myogenesis. A lack of CMET disrupts secondary myogenesis and a euro as an LBX1 a euro prevents the formation of limb musculature. This local action of FGFs with their ATK receptors is classified as paracrine signaling. Families equals epidermal growth factor receptor family equals 
The ERBB protein family or epidermal growth factor receptor family is a family of four structurally related receptor tyrosine kinases. Insufficient ERBB signaling in humans is associated with the development of neurodegenerative diseases, such as multiple sclerosis and Alzheimer's disease. In mice, loss of signaling by any member of the ERBB family results in embryonic lethality with defects in organs including the lungs, skin, heart, and brain. Excessive ERBB signaling is associated with the development of a wide variety of types of solid tumor. ERBB1 and ERBB2 are found in many human cancers and their excessive signaling may be critical factors in the development and malignancy of these tumors. Equals fibroblast growth factor receptor family equals Fibroblast growth factors comprise the largest family of growth factor ligands at 23 members. The natural alternate splicing of four fibroblast growth factor receptor genes results in the production of over 48 different isoforms of FGFR. These isoforms vary in their ligand binding properties and kinase domains. However, all share a common extracellular region composed of three immunoglobulin-like domains, and thus belong to the immunoglobulin superfamily. Interactions with FGFs occur via FGF at domains D2 and D3. Each receptor can be activated by several FGFs. In many cases, the FGFs themselves can also activate more than one receptor. This is not the case with FGF7, however, which can activate only FGFR2B. A gene for a fifth FGFR protein, FGFR5, has also been identified. In contrast to FGFRs 1 to 4, it lacks a cytoplasmic tyrosine kinase domain, and one isoform, FGFR5I cubed, only contains the extracellular domains D1 and D2. Equals vascular endothelial growth factor receptor family equals. Vascular endothelial growth factor is one of the main inducers of endothelial cell proliferation and permeability of blood vessels. Two RTKs bind to VEGF at the cell surface, VEGFR1 and VEGFR2. The VEGF receptors have an extracellular portion consisting of seven egg like domains, so, like FGFRs, belong to the immunoglobulin superfamily. They also possess a single transmembrane spanning region and an intracellular portion containing a split tyrosine kinase domain. VEGFA binds to VEGFR1 and VEGFR2. VEGFR2 appears to mediate almost all of the known cellular responses to VEGF. The function of VEGFR1 is less well defined, although it is thought to modulate VEGFR2 signaling. Another function of VEGFR1 may be to act as a dummy decoy receptor, sequestering VEGF from VEGFR2 binding. A third receptor has been discovered. However, VEGFA is not a ligand for this receptor. VEGFR3 mediates lymphangiogenesis in response to VEGFC and VEGFD. Equals RET receptor family equals. The natural alternate splicing of the RET gene results in the production of three different isoforms of the protein RET. RET51, RET43, and RET9 contain 51, 43, and 9 amino acids in their C-terminal tail, respectively. The biological roles of isoforms RET51 and RET9 are the most well studied in vivo, as these are the most common isoforms in which RET occurs. RET is the receptor for members of the glial cell line derived neurotrophic factor family of extracellular signaling molecules or ligands. In order to activate RET, first GFLs must form a complex with a glycosyl phosphate adenosine or anchored co receptor. The co receptors themselves are classified as members of the GDNF receptor I plus or minus protein family. Different members of the GFRI plus or minus family exhibit a specific binding activity for a specific GFLs. Upon GFL GFRI plus or minus complex formation, the complex then brings together two molecules of RET, triggering transautophosphorylation of specific tyrosine residues within the tyrosine kinase domain of each RET molecule. Phosphorylation of these tyrosines then initiates intracellular signal transduction processes. Equals F receptor family equals. 
epinephrine and F receptors are the largest subfamily of RTKs. Equals discoid in domain receptor family equals. The DDRs are unique RTKs in that they bind to collagens rather than soluble growth factors. See also. References. External links. Tyrosine kinase receptors at the U.S. National Library of Medicine Medical Subject Headings, EC 2.7.10.1